Hello, and welcome to Bucky's. I told you I'd bring you to Bucky's. Well, here we are. We're out. I'm, I'm parked up at the front. So, well, here, let me spin around. This is I-10 West. It's the Cane Island Parkway. That's Cane Island Parkway down there, if you can see, in Katy, Texas. So this is the main entrance. And now I'm going to turn the camera around as we go inside. Flashback. Getting gas at Bucky's. When I first got to Bucky's, I stopped at the closest pump to where you come in because those are the pumps that tend to be available. People go and park by the front, get the pumps right in front of the front door, then leave their cars, go inside, and you know spend 20 minutes. So the pumps near the doors were, are never available. So skip gas as soon as you come in or drive all the way down and then go back and park near the doors and go inside. Now you'll notice here we have a lot of kinds of gas. They have the, the, the three kinds of you know regular gas. And $4.49 was a good price that particular day. But you notice they also have the ethanol free for $6.19 and they also sell diesel. So it's a, it's, a, it's a great place to get gas no matter what kind of vehicle you drive, unless it's a big truck. Trucks are not allowed at Bucky's. So after I finished getting my gas, then I pulled over and parked and did the little stand up, hello, welcome thing that you saw at the beginning. Then I started going inside, but I had bumped the screen, which put it into a touch focus thing so that everything from that point was out of focus until I realized it about 10 minutes later inside the store. So when I go, when we go back, we're going to kind of jump cut to the middle of the store next to a, next to a truck that's parked in the middle of the store. And that's where the video will start. So enjoy our trip to Bucky's. But this is the Studa Beaver. The bed, by the way, is filled with little stuffed Bucky's. Here's their tie-dye selection, bathing suits. Okay, so we have all this stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> it just never ends. Oh, we're at the cigarette end. Okay, so I guess we can turn around and go back. Montana Silversmiths. T-shirts. More T-shirts. There's T-shirts over here. There's T-shirts over here. There's T-shirts everywhere. <laughs> Ooh, candles, because you really want candles from a gas station. scented oils oh this is just amazing now if you want a special order of sandwich apparently you do it here at these stations oh this is the fudge I have to stay away from here oh cookie dough oh look they have a cookie dough station you can buy just raw cookie dough cookie dough bites oh my god I can't have any of this. <laughs> oh, it's so bad for me. <laughs> Peanut butter, uh, chocolate pecan, walnut. Oh, praline. Oh, I heard they make good praline. They look good. Peanut butter, chocolate fudge. Now we're talking. Ooh, Rocky Road. M&M's. <laughs> oh. More and more and more. Love the tacos. Bacon, beans, eggs, cheese, potatoes, and green sauce. Yeah. Or tortilla taco meat. Oh, beans and cheese. Chicken fajita mix. And the rhino is sausage, beans, eggs, potatoes, and green sauce. Now the hippo was bacon. Oh, bacon and sausage. Okay. Oh, no, don't worry. Ooh, cheese stick. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. The kolaches are supposed to be really good too. I might have to get one of those before I go. He's making the greatest breakfast biscuit in the world. <laughs> or she is. 
Okay. Pulled pork, sliced turkey, tacos, all sorts of tacos. Make, they make their own chips. Sliced brisket, chopped brisket. What? Sliced brisket or chopped brisket? Fried chicken, club milk. Club milk is ham, smoked turkey, peppered bacon, chip. Oh, I'm getting one of these. Okay, now we're back. This is the center. This is the front door over here. And there's the soda machines along the back and snacks and more stuff. Restrooms. The coffee station, which is huge. Ice cream. Nuts. More nuts. <laughs> more nuts. I love the nuts. Oh, look, more nuts. More nuts. <laughs> chocolate covered, dark chocolate covered pecan. Okay, I'm. Okay, when I stop filming, I'm grabbing a chopping basket and filling up. Actually, I might keep filming. Okay, these are candies. I'm not really a candy fan. Or gummies. Or dried fruit or jerky. But. Of course, this is just beer. And snacks. All the snacks you could ever want. Charcoal. Chips. I'll get some chips for later too. Well, maybe not. Oh, sugar free. Sugar free jerky. I may have to get some of this. Oh, their tip top pop is really good. These trail mix, where is the one? There's one called Peanut Butter Blast. Here we go. Peanut Butter Blast. Peanuts, honey roasted peanuts, peanut butter cups, or chips, peanut butter candies, mini peanut butter cups, and peanut butter coated pretzel balls. <laughs> I've gone through several of these. My friend Brian brings them back when he goes to Bucky's when he goes to Florida. I have found everything I want. So I need to get, I'm getting a couple of peanut butter blasts because they are fantastic. The tip top pop, a couple of those. Ooh, they have organic sea salt. Ooh, white pepper chow. Ah, jalapeno may be a little spicy too. Oh. Another one of those. Granola bites. I got pretzels, chips. Well, I got popcorn, so I don't really need chips. Oh, look, there's more popcorn over here. Okay, I don't need charcoal. <laughs> oh, look, they had peanut butter blast over here. I didn't have to walk all the way over there to get it. And there's more jerky and more dried nuts. Oh, nuts. I was going to get some nuts. They had dark chocolate pecan, but I don't see dark chocolate other. I see, ooh, dark chocolate cashews. Getting some of those. Dark chocolate almonds, oh yeah. Get some of those. I'll skip the pecans. That's my diet, no pecans. I'm on the no pecan diet. Okay, now what do I need? Sandwiches. Oh wait, no, I need a frozen Dr. Pepper. Okay. Put this in the little cup holder. See, that's the thing, the place is so big, they have to stock multiple locations with different things. Okay, club milk, absolutely. And I think I'm going with sliced brisket. Oh, and I got, I got to get some beaver chips. Well, I already bought the sandwiches, so I shouldn't go keep shopping. But in Bucky's, it's hard to stop shopping. Oh, look at this. This is where they're sugaring the nuts. <laughs> 
go nuts. Look at that. And see, and then they sell them in these little, uh, Okay, I will get some cinnamon glazed pecans. Oh, they're warm. <laughs> what else we got? Okay, I've been back to the burrito bar. No burritos. So, oh, here's the, the, the Studa Beaver from the other side. It's up on blocks. Little Bucky's footballs. Again, the bed's full of little Bucky's. I'm just here for the snacks. If I'm going to buy a shirt, this would be the shirt because I am really just here for the snacks. <laughs> of course, if I buy the shirt, that makes me a liar. Oh, look, bathing suits. What are they? they must have Bucky's Hawaiian shirts. I need to look for one. I don't see it down there. I don't see it over here. Here's some more shirts over this way. No. Wait, there's some pat. Those are probably women's stuff. Yeah, this is women's stuff over here. Yeah, those are like caftan kind of things for women. No, I don't. I'm sure it exists. Oh, wait. There's another wall back here. Well, I think if there were going to be Hawaiian shirts, they'd be better. Well, there's kind of, wait, wait, I see a, I see a potential. It's technically not a Hawaiian shirt, but it has little buckies all over it. <laughs> These are all little, though. I don't think they expect big, big people like me to buy these things, or, or they sell out. Yeah, I don't, they don't have anything large, extra large. They do have extra large, okay. I'm thinking I gotta get one of these. Well, as you can tell, I hate loud clothes. <laughs> that is gorgeous. And you have to look close to see that it's Bucky's. <laughs> Okay, you just you just made Bucky some more money. <laughs> you just made Bucky's more money because I'm gonna go buy some. I tell you what, because I love this the way it feels. So the fabric is the same and the collar and that, but it won't have Bucky on it. Over there. Well, I want one with Bucky's, but I also like some without There Bucky's. you go. That's Thank you so much. Oh, buttons. <laughs> oh, can't look uh, bottle openers. <laughs> Little magnetic Bucky's bottle openers. Four dollars though, I'm not paying for it. Well, I'm buying it. <laughs> I'm, I'm buying the Bucky's bottle opener for four dollars. Okay, so the nice lady told me that there were more shirts like this Bucky's shirt, but without the Bucky's logo. Oh, I see, I see them over there in the corner. Okay. Ooh, all sorts of little Texas memorabilia. We are in Texas after all. And I believe it's the law in Texas that you have to carry Texas memorabilia. Oh, yeah, look at these shirts. Ooh, Bucky's Nuggies. Those are supposed to be really good. Oh, cowboy hats. We got a Jackie Robinson. Who is this? Oh, Empire Strikes Back. Okay, I don't need a Batman. Ooh, Fourth of July. Yeah. Do they have an X? They do have an XL in this. Oh, it's Captain America, too. So it's Captain America. I'm not even looking at how much things cost. I'm just throwing them in my basket. I'm getting that. Jurassic World, Budweiser, another Captain America, Looney Tunes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, don't want that one. Oh, who's back here? Who's hiding behind the Budweiser? Oh, more Budweiser. It's just a different print. Y'all just standing here waiting to take my money? Okay, I don't want to be on camera, okay? Well, I, no, not to worry. I'm going to aim it at me. So I can see my face when you give me the toad when I freak out. Because <laughs> this really nice lady back there said, well, if you like this Bucky shirt, there's all these other ones over here. <laughs> And did you get this? I did not get the ice cream. <laughs> Is there anything else for you? 
I think that's enough. Holy crap! Wait, I I have to aim the camera at this. Two hundred and twenty-five dollars. And thirty-two cents. Well, I, I can I can deal with the thirty-two cents. Oh, you take Apple Pay, even better. Because then I just have to double tap. Okay, I had to stop one more time to show you the deer corn. Burling wood, firewood, deer corn. Well, that was the Bucky's adventure. I hope you had $225 worth of fun watching it because that's how much it cost me because all the crap I bought. But it was a lot, a lot of that was the shirts and the shirts were much more expensive. Most of the other stuff I bought was all under five, you know, like five, ten dollars But I did buy a lot. Now I'm going to go back to my sister's house who also lives in Katy, which made this very convenient for filming, and eat those sandwiches and show you those. So I'll see you again in a minute. Eleven minutes later. So I'm back at my sister's house, and now I'm going to eat those sandwiches. This is the sliced brisket. Yeah, it looks pretty good. But this other one, this is the Bucky's Club. Oh my God. It's got bacon, it's got turkey. Oh my goodness, okay. And of course the Bucky's chips, beaver chips, of course. Well, let me. Brisket sandwich is good, but it's not like it's the best barbecue. People talk like it's the best barbecue they ever had. If, they, if that's true, I feel very sorry for these people. Although for a gas station barbecue sandwich, it's awesome. <laughs> Okay, the club. This is what club sandwiches should be like everywhere. Oh, the ham is smoked. The pork, oh. The cheese, the bacon. It's pepper bacon. Oh my God. This is the best club sandwich I've ever had. And the spice just hit me. It's a little spicy. I don't think most, <laughs> if you don't like spicy food, don't get the club. Hope you enjoyed the trip to Bucky's. Thanks for stopping by. See you next time. Bye-bye.